What is going on guys? Welcome to today's video. Uh, today we're going to show you a super simple tutorial. We're going to be swapping out the rear uh, slide plate on a Glock to a new holster product. Uh, the first thing we're going to do, make sure we're empty. I've already done that. And we're going to disassemble the firearm. You can just set the frame aside. Uh, this holster product is available online. I will include a link in the description. Just going to go ahead and dump everything out. Super simple, guys. You don't even need to take the barrel or the spring off. Just right in here, there's a little piece of plastic right in there. You're going to poke it in, and you're going to just push down as you push the plate out. So watch this. See how easy that was? So now the plate is snapped out. We can remove that and set it aside. And now all we're going to be doing is replacing it with this CNC machined part. So we're going to start it. We're going to push down. Uh, let's see here. So the goal here is to just push down that part that we were depressed while we slide this back. Should be easy enough. Okay, so we got it started. And now we're going to take our pin and depress the last part right there. And we should be in business. Let's see. Play around with it. It'll work. There we go. We're snapped into place now. You can see the new striker plate. This is CNC, so even by itself, by itself, it is an upgrade. Uh, so what we can do now, we can reassemble the firearm. We're locked in. The plate's there. So now the cool part, we'll take our hardware here. Number one. And the kit comes with a lot of extras, so this is great. If you are, are prone to losing stuff like I am, and we're going to line this up on the back. And we are going to install the hardware. Let's get it started. We got one. And here is two. Let's tighten it up with the included Allen key. Cool thing is, is it's cut out for the ejection port, so you don't actually need to worry about that. Let's get this good and tight. And we are all done after this. Just tighten everything up. Good on the right side. Good on the left side. And there you go. So now you have your slim clip holster. You can pocket your Glock. No hindrance of the sights. No hindrance of the ejection port. Fully functional. And uh, now you just stick it in your belt loop just like a pocket knife. So hope this video was helpful. Again, link in the description below for this product. Give it a thumbs up, share it with some friends. Have a great day.